But first up, Lizzie hits the harbour. A family day out by the water is nice, but a family day out on the water is really nice. Captain James, what a beautiful boat. Welcome on board. Let's go. Come on, Abby, let's jump on. We've shown you fishing, we've shown you sailing, water skiing, wakeboarding, Hobie cats, so many sports you can do with a boat. But sometimes you just need to head off, hang out and relax. There are three ways to get out on the water. One is charter a boat, two, buy a boat, or three, find some friends with a boat. And I found some friends. woo -hoo! James, Clyde, Alyssa and Abby are treating me to a day on Sydney Harbour. We're heading for Chowder Bay, named after the old whalers who made chowder soup from all the seafood they caught in the bay. We're just getting morning tea. Are we feeling hungry, everyone? Yeah! Let's go get some food. Because I forgot to pack the picnic. So, James, Chowder Bay, what a beautiful spot. And it's great now that the wharf is open for the public to tie up their boat. That's it, it's a magic spot. We can go to the restaurant for dinner, yeah. or we can go to the cafe for morning tea. And is there coffee involved? We can certainly have a coffee for morning tea. Oh, thanks for asking. I'd love a slight white, James. Let's Absolutely. go. Let's go. <laughs> the Chino Kiosk at Chowder Bay is the old munitions store from the days when all this was a military base. It's the cutest cafe ever. Well, look how beautiful it is. Magic spot. The coffee is good. The cakes are delicious. You can sit for a while or grab coffee to go and get back on the water. Bobby! Let's take this boat for a run. The Spit is our next stop. I didn't really forget the picnic. I organised this. A couple of platters from Kiosco by Omeggio on the jetty of Dalbora Marina. They specialise in Italian street food. But we're taking their street food to the water. Call ahead, they'll have lunch ready for you when you pull up to the berth. Can wow! You go, guys? Oh, amazing! What have you got? Hot seafood platter. Cold seafood and platter. I have the hot seafood platter, oh. guys. How is that for a picnic? Ooh, very fancy. Engines are go, and we're off to find a picnic spot. Don't drop the platter, whatever you do. Sydney Harbour has so many secret corners to explore. We're into Middle Harbour now, and Sugarloaf Bay is sweet. And this has got to be Sydney's most beautiful picnic spot. Let's dive in, everyone. Oh, so yum. Do you have some favourite Sydney spots on the water? We do have some secret little spots, but you can always find a quiet bay where no one else is. Uh, this is a personal favourite in here, in Sugarloaf Bay, but anywhere up Middle Harbour, up the Parramatta River, the Lane Cove, there's lots of quiet corners where you can hide. Abby, what's your favourite thing about going on the boat? I think just going out with my family, going swimming and picking up lunch and having it. So much fun. Even Clissy the rabbit loves going on the boat. How cute is this? Abby's made a life jacket for her bunny, because we all know every bunny needs to be safe on the water. Good old-fashioned family time. <laughs> Absolutely. I love that. And I bet the kids get really, really excited. They do. Absolutely. Boating's something everyone can do. Buy one, hire one, or buddy up with that mate with a boat and get out on the water on your Sydney Weekender. A family day out at 40 knots. What do we think of that? <laughs> For more info on how to get you and your family out on the water, visit myboatinglife.com.au.